As major holidays approach, people are streaming into shore communities, but those towns say they want to avoid the potential spread of the virus. Joe Holden spoke with people in several shore communities about what they are doing to keep people safe. For many, a trip to the shore would normally happen this weekend. With Passover and Easter soon in full swing, shore town populations surge. But not this year, not with government mandated stay at home orders. But those orders have presented challenges for families with loved ones working on the front line, like Dr. Chris Davis. His wife has some health issues and has been staying at the family's second home in Avalon for her own safety. There was a potential that, that residents were asked to leave their secondary home and come to their uh, primary home, which I understand because of you know the risk of spreading the virus. Um, however, she had been down there for the, the recommended 14 days, so I was hoping that she would be able to stay down there. In a time of mixed signals, Davis has had concerns police will ask his wife and daughter to leave. We don't want to spread the virus, but in situations where people have self-quarantined and they're in a safe area, um, you know, it's got to be a case-by-case -case basis, basically. To clear up any confusion, CBS3 contacted Governor Phil Murphy's office. They clarified there has never been an order banning owners of secondary homes from staying there. They did point out, quote, the governor strongly recommended people not go to their second homes because there is a lack of hospital capacity. The chief of police for Avalon sent me the following in an email, quote, the Avalon Police Department is doing everything we can to prepare and plan for this COVID-19 pandemic. We are doing our part as individuals and officers to help stop the spread of this virus. As you may be aware, Avalon has canceled all events and closed beaches and parks in preparation for holiday weekends approaching. Rest assured that we are doing all we can. The safety of everyone is our primary goal. As Governor Phil Murphy has repeatedly emphasized flattening the curve, there's underscoring the fact that this is no time for fun and games and enjoying a holiday weekend down the shore. Though, of course, there will be always unique situations. In Delaware County, Joe Holden, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.